Our devotional thought from the Old Testament today is still coming from the book of Exodus, Exodus chapter 29. I want you just to think of this thought. God wants to be with his people. God wants to be with his people. Now listen to what he says to the people of Israel, beginning with verse 44. Yes, I will consecrate the tabernacle and the altar, and I will consecrate Aaron and his sons to serve me as priests. Then I will live among the people of Israel and be their God. I will live among the people of Israel and be their God. And they will know that I am the Lord their God. I am the one who brought them out of the land of Egypt so that I could live among them. I am the Lord their God. Now, we've always taught you that God has always had a desire for fellowship with man from the creation of the first man, Adam and Eve, until today with the recreated man. God desires to be with us. Now, beloved, sometimes you and I, it doesn't fit into our comprehension. Why would God want to live with me? Why would God want to be with me? Why would God want to hang out with me? Because he loves you. A few weeks ago, Sister Bev was putting up some pictures of, of our beginnings together, our first ministry when I was Cookie Monster and she was Pink Panther in a children's church, Assemblies of God in Springfield, Missouri, our, our first together ministry. And she showed pictures of us when we first became your pastors here in Manila. And I looked at that beautiful girl and thought, why in the world did she want to be with me? There's only one reason, because she loved me. There's only one reason God wants to be with you. He has chosen to love you.